right, just finished from the exam hall and it was some parts were hard kind of and some parts were okay so what so first of all I did um, oh I did comprehension and you had to like find some answers from the text and you had to use your inverse skills and then I did I think maths or non or nonverbal and in maths it was basically long maths and there was there were um like data questions and there was also where you had to find angles and um, questions like that and in non-verbals just shapes and rotations um, and like there were patterns and that's really all and then in the second part there was non-verbal and there was also jumbled words well sentences jumbled sentences and in non-verbal it was the same thing um in maths it was short maths so there was something take away something and you had to find the answer to the question um, there was fractions you had to sim well you had to change the denominators into the same so that they're the same and the booklets that I was doing the nonverbal was similar as well in the mock exam, I felt like I wasn't going to pass it because the maths, there were loads of data questions, and I couldn't work that out on time, and a question that I didn't know. But in the exam, the like real exam, I felt like I would just pass like I would just make the cutoff mark that's how I felt when I was doing the chaos well test online the English was similar to what I did in the exam for the comprehension I, w I was a bit okay and for the jumbled sentences and those I was okay with it and it was good and it was not too hard and the long maths there were 20 questions and you had to do it in 21 minutes because it was long maths so People will take quite 
a long time to work it out so they gave us one minute more four 16 questions you have to do in eight minutes because people could work it out quickly and that was where you had to find um, the correct words for different sentences because in the question it said there were options like and the options weren't specific in English there was basically in English you had to um, find some words that would fit into the sentence and it should make sense and there were different words from A to J and yeah the comprehension was about this girl in a maze and there were questions like um, why did she think that the maze was easy and there were options like because she had information no one else had or because her mother told her and stuff like that and in the text it said um, something different 